blog youtube channel this is sekina giving you all of the gist story and any other thing you need to know concerning news entertainment and you know so today hmm, i have a lot of news as usual and i'm going to start with noretta loretta anoche the p i mean the special assistant to the president has denied being a member of apc hmm. he said i have no partisanship in my blood i have seen many petitions against my nomi my nomination not only from the pdp but also from some apc members i am not partisan they know it is about the law no one has no one has any reason to fear for my nomination as INEC commissioner representing delta as far as I am concerned, I am Madame Due Process. That is why I have been having all of these attacks. I follow due process. I follow the law. Hmm. But I mean, this man is like a special advisor to the president. Why would she deny not being? Why would she deny not being a, a, a member of APC? And she even says she's not a member of PDP too. She says she's Madame Due Process. I, hey, okay. Madam, you process. We wish you luck on being the INEC commissioner. <laughs> so, going to the next story. Hmm. So, a corpse was found in Ghana in um Kausau Okpaikuma, specifically. So, a 34 year old man named Nafisa Nafisa was found dead. In this camp this church camp um, named Christ Shepherd prayer camp so this woman has been suffering mental illness here yeah? so she went to this camp and she's been there for like months and then all of a sudden they start looking for air they're looking for air they look for air they, they like contacted the police it was like a thorough search around the community around the camp like everywhere and then all of a sudden they found this woman in the toilet where the children use this man and then it was like in the pit hole like it was like it is unbelievable i mean why would they kill somebody or maybe why would she die in a hole do you understand like she was right like, compressed and then how did they even find her so when they're like been find looking for her looking for her looking for her looking for her checking i mean asking the police police searching people searching you know everybody in the camp looking for her then our mother Came outside so like let's check the toilet that's how they went to the toilet though as they went to the toilet they saw the ladies corpse so now people are like they need to suspect the mother because i mean why would you even think of your babe i mean your daughter sorry my bad how would you think of your daughter dying in the toilet like you now even know the specific place like she's like yeah like people are like you need to suspect this woman because what uh-uh you know if you think of any other you know if you know no more person be like ah, why is my daughter missing no we need to you know she has mental illness she might have like trek to this place she might have gone to this place she might have you know you know people that have mental illness they might they, they, they do a lot of stuff a lot of very very weird stuff unbelievable stuff so like she okay maybe going to the toilet to Going to the toilet is also unbelievable, but then why would you just think your daughter is in this toilet? Do you see? Probably she, you know, is in a church camp. Maybe she has seen. Maybe you know, um, maybe she sees. You know, people that sleep and see something in their dream, or people that just like meditate and they see something. Maybe they just say like, I'm like, okay, okay, this is where the thing is. Maybe that's the kind of person she is. But then they need to be so so suspicious of her because uh uh, like. Anyways, her IP now, Fisa. So Nigeria as a country, Nigerians, like as its citizens, we have been grieving, we have been mourning because what? We lose, we lost Sound Sultan. I mean, I am not even close to his family, but then, uh-uh, Sound Sultan has so many memories now. Like this man, like, I mean, I follow his Instagram and he's very, very, you know, they be like, don't believe what is on social media, yeah? Quite the right. But then, I feel like he has led a good life on social media. And he has led out of social media. Because lots and lots and lots and lots of celebrities keep coming out to like, 
give this like to pay their tribute so this man has like been he has been um he he, he lost his life to cancer at the age of 44 at the age of 44 is young he has so many things like so many other imp impacts you know to like key him to give he's working on his ep with whiskey big whiz sorry <laughs> i'm not supposed to bring that in but he's working on his ep with big whiz and then so you know lots of celebrities came outside to pay their tribute and i'm going to read a few basket mouth said for over 20 years, not once did I see you lose your cool. A wise man, a humble man, kind-hearted, a true definition of a good friend. I will definitely miss those very early hours of the day that I will call you and share my crazy ideas with you while taking notes as you throw in your genius touch. You were selfless, disciplined, and professional, unarguably, unarguably, one of the best writers I have seen, a brilliant actor, a musician, and even though you never did it, you were one of the best comedians I have ever seen. One of the most creative humans I have ever met, extremely intelligent, with so much love to give. We lost a good man today, we lost a great man. You were the best of us all and I will miss you so much. I love you salty, salty. I don't know, I'm reading this and I'm having goosebumps. It sounds so genuine, it sounds like really really touching then dj do, um do dotson we all know dotson that the presenter he said few days ago he was still considering his friend the midst of everything we lost a great guy i feel there are so many many tributes from funky akidele from yabo joe from sik bay from cafe dance from big from big 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 celebrities so many celebrities have been crying so many there is this girl now that's what i mean that's worry no 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 that's not it's not that's worry girl not that worry picking there are two different people she said that she was robbed around like last month and then she said she because and um some sort and have a work they have some work they have not finished then she's like ah bro sorry oh i lost my phone like that's why I, I was robbed and all that please let me continue your work this this that and he had already paid that then he was like what send me your account number and she was like ah no bro so don't no no don't send me all because i, I you already paid me for your so like no he was like no he insisted and still gave her money and she, she was like he's a very very selfless person he does not like he in, 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 he understands people to the core. I mean, I all these tributes, all these good, 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 good tributes from good, good, big, big, big celebrities like ones that have name in the entertainment industry. Even from Kadele, she like she was she was all theory. Whiskey, whiskey that does not post at all. This guy he had to post. He wrote broken hearted. Me that I'm not related to him, I felt it because ah no, he led a very very good life. You know, there's a difference between not knowing somebody and following their Instagram. Like okay, I know this person is so cool. It was not even age. Ah no no, we, I feel like ah no no, they lost a good one. No, they truly they, yes. I mean, according to all of them, they all said they lost a good. One. They truly have lost a good one. And I don't know what's up with it. It is July with death death. I mean, this guy that died, Obama DMW, was 44 and he died. Now, some sort of I'm between how many weeks, how many days? What is going on? God, I beg. We don't want to cry. We don't want to mourn. Not even the good ones. I'm not saying people, I'm not saying God should kill people, but not even the good ones. Not, not people that are even laying good legacy. Now, Sal Sultan is left with is he left his wife and three kids, yeah, and siblings now. After working all your days, after working, working your youthful days, working, making money, trying to make money, trying to survive, working, doing all sort of dirty stuff because there's no how no how. Uh, uh, there are so many dirty things in the, even in the industry. After doing a lot of it, when it's time for you to now okay, calm down and start like enjoying your life. Then you now died. Ha! Oh my God! Oh God! I beg, keep all of us. Enough of these days. We don't want to cry again over anybody. Amen. So going to the next story. Going to the next news.
Hmm. This one has to be one of the highlights. Bob Risky <laughs> showed off his sexy butt on Instagram. Even me that I'm a girl said I'm not as sexy as that. <laughs> am I jealous of Bob? Yes, I am jealous. Because a man, oh, we all know Bob Risky. A man that just I, he said he has is now a transgender, but I don't feel like it because I saw some um videos of um I mean sorry, not videos, the picture is looking like his thing is still there, but then he said he has is now a transgender. So let's just believe his words. Because you know, I can't see what's under him. So so my brisky yo is now a sexy lady that is ready ready to steal everybody's man in nigeria <laughs> and this one doesn't even close man so we say it's better keep your man keep your boyfriend because i don't have you know i'm not i don't have um how will i say it i don't have i don't have mercy yo. i just go if he has money if he has money then i'm going for it it's only God that we give all of us, the rest of us, money that we want to our own. <laughs> ah, okay, anyways, yeah, but it still looks good, you know, it looks good since it's a girl now. So, she looks good. So, that is that about today's news. Always come back here. Please, merci. Okay. Bye, and do subscribe. Thank you.